<laughs> Hi there. Welcome back to another Bob Blast. Hi, I'm Bob Burridge, and this one is all about my excitement about this Windows series that's going on. I'm so excited about this because so many of you have joined up, and there are like 20, 222 members have signed up, over 2,000 comments and posts. And uh, uh, you know, remember, it's my it's on my Windows Series Facebook group. So that would be Robert Burridge Facebook group if you want to go see them. But I'm enjoying everyone's paintings. They're all so different. Remember, this is what I was working on on the, my last Bob Blast. It's all about the windows uh, and window lighting. Some of them are about reflection. Some of them are about backlit. And then my figures, because I love to bring in the, uh, the figures. And of course, this is about everybody's different interpretations. So keep them coming. I'm, ex I'm excited about this, how everyone from all over the world is posting their images. What a great way to reach out across the world, especially during this time where some of us feels though we're stuck in the studio. I find it to be liberating. I can do anything I want to, but I thought a focus such as like Windows series, there you go. You are all invited. I hope you all join. Now it's, it's time to work on some more paintings. What I did here on an earlier one, this is a 30 inch by 30 inch canvas, you see. And, and uh, I was putting down collage paper. I was throwing down the, the whole bind inks and, and more glue. And now I'm starting to draw in a figure. And I thought maybe, well, it's drying right now. I want to work on it, but it's drying right now. But for this next section, I'm going to work on the same kind of a concept. Paper collage, paint on it, the transparent uh, inks from Holbein inks, and now it has dried, and I'm going to work on it. It'll be part of my window series. Stay tuned. And so here we go. Got to put on my apron. It's my Mr. Rogers act. <laughs> put it on my apron. So my setup is uh, I had the canvas already secured onto the, the, the wall. I use tape and nails to keep it nice and sturdy. My table is already set up. I'm right-handed, so I'm going to put everything on the right side. I have my color wheel, okay? I have my collage papers. I'm going to be doing more collage on this piece. I have my paper towels. These are my inks. These are the acrylic Holbein inks that I've been talking about so much. And I put them in these, these uh, markers. These are refillable acrylic ink markers. They're pretty cool. So I have all these different colors. Here's happens to be white. So I like to draw with these acrylic inks. The white is very opaque. Here are my uh, acrylic paints. I haven't figured out yet what the color combination is going to be. I have my glue. This is my gel medium. I use a lot of it and my brushes ready to go. You can see these are my big brushes for the, for the glue, big brushes for the glue. And then these are my uh, two inch wide painting brushes. Well, I'm going to be working large, so I use large brushes. So many of us go to the little brushes. What the heck are you going to do with a little brush? You'll poke your eye out with that thing. So anyway, big brushes. I'm going to continue on with this window series. And here we go. So I like to start off with collage, just because it's like way too much fun. Big brush for my gel medium, gel medium, and all kinds of tissue papers with patterns on them. That's what I'm starting with, okay? So, big bucket. Now I'm going to use a lot of glue. This is the gel medium. You can see it, it's kind of white, it's transparent. It's going to dry optically clear. Don't worry about that part, okay? I use lots 
of glue. That's parts really important. I hear so many people say, oh, I get bubbles. Well, use more glue and lots of it. So everybody makes a gel medium. They all work basically. So here we go. So I, I wanted to do more patterns on this side, kind of representing maybe a woman's dress or patterns in a dress. At least that's the concept. So I had an idea, at least. Here we go. And then I put more glue on top of it. It really seals it really nice and tight. And I try not to make too much sense at this point. This is me <laughs> playing in the sandbox, which I love to do so much. Let's do some more down in here. This makes no sense, right? But it sure does if you like to play. And again, and notice how I use a large brush with more glue on top of it. It almost acts as if it's sealing. See if it, here's some more patterns. More patterns. Oh, this is cool. Now these are patterns that I made myself on a larger format than Xerox, them smaller. Different sizes. At least I have ownership. You know what I'm saying? As opposed to going out and buying a book that has all these patterns in them. That looks like everybody else's. So I like to make my own patterns. Ownership. That's goofy. I like where all this is going. See, nice and flat. Nice and flat. I'm really pushing the paper so it's flat. Okay. Let's do a couple more. Well, this one on some ty typography. Typography is always fun. I happen to like typography a lot. I used to teach it. Let's go up in here. Let's get out of this way. There we go. Let's get up there. Oh, I want to go over here too. Just to throw it off a little bit. Off balance. You know, break the cadence, that kind of a thing. Oh. I like it. Cool. Robert Rauschenberg is one of my favorite painters and collage artists. It's wonderful. So many in that era. Oh, look at some more of these. Now these, again, these are patterns that I made and then Xerox them. Black and whites, I do black and whites. Because I'm basically gonna change the color anyway. I like it. Oh. There we go. All right. So you saw me playing in the sandbox here. One of my favorite things to do. I'm going to let this dry, and now we're gonna get into color. Yay! So we'll let this one dry, and so my next Bob Blast, I'll get into color. But remember, this is all about you and your window paintings. I invite you to post your wonderful window paintings, your interpretation, all over the world. What a great way to communicate to all of us right now. Hey, thanks for watching. This is fun. And remember, the next one's all about color. <laughs>